to balance this equation, NaOH plus H2SO4 yields Na2SO4 plus H2O, let's count up the atoms on each side of the equation. For the sodium atom, we have one of those. Oxygens, we have one, but be careful, we have one here and we have four here. So we have a total of five oxygen atoms. Hydrogens, we only have one, but be careful again, there's two right here, so one plus two, that equals three, and there's only one sulfur. On the product side, we have two Na's, we have oxygens, we have four plus the one for a total of five oxygen atoms. Hydrogens, we have the two, and sulfurs, we have one. Looking at these numbers, we see the sodium, that's not balanced. The oxygens are balanced. Hydrogens, no, and then the sulfurs, they're balanced as well. Why don't we take and fix the sodiums first and see what happens? So if I put a two in front of the sodium, the one times the two, that'll give me two sodiums, but now I've got to update my oxygens. So I have one times two, I have two oxygens, plus the four here, I have six oxygens, and I need to update my hydrogens as well. I have the one times the two, so two hydrogens, and then I have these two here. So I have a total of four hydrogen atoms. Sulfurs, they stay the same. Over on the product side, the sodium, that's balanced, and then the oxygens, not balanced, hydrogens, not balanced. It seems the easiest thing to do is fix the hydrogens right now. I do like to leave the oxygens till last. So why don't we put a two in front of the H2O, and now two times two, That'll give us four hydrogen atoms, and those are balanced, and then we need to update the oxygens. So we have our four oxygens here, and now we have the one times the two, two, so we have six oxygens, and the equation's balanced. The key to the equation, and where people have problems, is that we have one oxygen here, and they forget they need to add these, or we have the one hydrogen, and they forget to add the two here. So make sure you add up all the atoms when you're balancing the chemical equation. This is Dr. B with the balanced equation for sodium hydroxide plus sulfuric acid yields sodium sulfate and water. Thanks for watching.